previously on Minecraft Story Mode. Everything in the universe starts out as just a block. What comes of those blocks is up to those who wield them. And in every block, there lies the potential to create or destroy. Our friends have traveled far and wide in search of the Order of the Stone. And a way to stop the Wither Storm for good. But even well-laid plans can go awry. The strong can grow weak. and beloved heroes can fall. And though some glimmer of hope may remain, the threat to this world, to its very existence, is far from over. Witherstorm isn't dead yet, not even close. The what now? Who are you? Jesse, Jesse, where are you? Say something, Jesse! We're coming! No way, no way! You found Gabriel? Who's Gabriel? We need to get out of here now! This way! You made it! And... Gabriel? Did you say Gabriel? Look out! Those Endermen are running the wrong way! They'll be killed! Soren? I can't stand by and watch. I'd be condemning them to death! Stop staring and get a move on! Well, I can't just abandon them, not after a lifetime of study. Your head's gonna be abandoning your body if you don't turn around and run! Jesse! They're falling behind! Axel, you gotta move faster! She's too sick. This is the best we can do. They're not gonna be able to outrun it. Not on foot! We gotta find a way to move faster. We're all gonna be caught in the tractor beam! We need transportation. Anyone seen a minecart? I think Axel still has one from the Nether, but it won't help. We need to lay down too much track. Then we'll have to use the next best thing. Everybody, get on! Just hang on. I've got Petra! Then I'll take Gabriel. Hold on, this might be a bumpy ride. Come on, horses! Whatever you do, don't look back. Ah! I looked. Everyone follow me! Woohoo! Jesse, look out! <laughs> this is awesome! Axel, stop backseat steering! I can't help it. I'm getting horse sick. Hey, 
It's gaining on us! No offense, but you can use a little practice. First time on a horse here! Watch it! You trying to knock me off this thing, Jesse? Sorry. Enderman move blocks. It's what they do. Guys, come on. We gotta build a new one, like right now. Come on, faster. We need more blocks. I got some. <laughs> Yeehaw! Woo! Oh, Axel, you're screaming in my ear. Sorry. actually freaking made it. Jesse, Gabriel was saying some pretty weird stuff back on that horse. He might have wither sickness. I don't know. You never acted the way he's been acting. I'll go talk to him. Hey, how are you feeling? I, I'm afraid I don't feel much like myself at the moment. Gabriel, it really is you. They told us you'd kicked it. Uh, who are you people? It's me, Magnus! Old friend, don't you recognize us? It's Soren. We've known each other for a very long time. He doesn't recognize me either. Well, he only just met you. But for him to forget us? <sighs> you! You're the one who rescued me! Tell me, please, what is going on? remember only blackness and then suddenly you were there up until a little while ago we all thought that you were you know <gasps> it was dark and foul and i was sure i was a goner well you aren't you made it back alive which is more than i can say for some of us oh man ellie for a second i Almost managed to forget. You guys talking about Eligard? I just can't believe she's gone. Doesn't feel real. How? How could this have happened? To lose not just a friend, but a member of the Order of the Stone! Guys, it was my fault. I'm the one who took Eligard's armor. But you couldn't have known what was going to happen. She's right. Don't blame yourself, kid. I, uh, never blame myself for anything. Ah! Being emotional is getting us nowhere! What I want to know is, what happened out there today? Why is that thing still alive? 
My instructions were simple. You were the one in the middle of everything. What went wrong? All we managed to do is make things worse. The command block is still out there, Soren. Blast! And now, to make matters worse, we've gone from one weather storm to three! Our plan was a total failure! I should have cast the foul thing into the abyss. Why didn't I destroy that cursed block ages ago? Look, our plan didn't work, so we obviously need a new one. The question is, what do we do? Uh, why are you asking me? Am I expected to know every last thing in the universe? Uh, I need a moment to think. Is he always like this? <laughs> you have no idea. That jacket! I recognize it! Lucas always wears that jacket. No. There were other people wearing that very same jacket when I was thrown from the monster! Ugh. It hurts just to think about. Hey, hey! It's okay! Jesse, if what Gabriel said is true... I mean, do you think? I thought for sure they were gone, but... If they were just trapped in the Wither Storm... Look, even if your friends are out there somewhere, there's nothing you can do for them. What? No. If they're alive, I have to go after them. They might need me, Jesse. Whoa. I suddenly feel really dizzy. Easy, easy. I gotcha. Hey, buddy. You doing okay? Of course you are. Wish I could say the same for everyone else. Gravel? No. Dirt? Don't think so. Lucas, what are you doing? I told you. I'm going after my friends. I thought the other ocelots were dead. But if they're not, I need to go find them. Look, I am grateful to you guys for bringing me this far. But I can't leave them alone out there. And what if Gabriel's wrong? In case you haven't noticed, he's not exactly firing on all cylinders right now. I've got to try, Jesse. Otherwise, I just couldn't live with myself. Oh, Lucas. Look, you and me, we've made a pretty good team so far. I'd even call us friends. So I hope you'll understand why I need to go help my old friends. They do it for me. I can't believe I'm saying this, but if your heart's telling you to go, then you gotta go. Otherwise, you'd be heartless or something. <laughs> Thank you, Jesse. I'll find them. And then I'll find you again, too. I promise. Thanks. <laughs> Some leftover cobblestone might come in handy. How are you doing? You look terrible, Petra. Your skin is, like, almost gray. Hey, way to not sugarcoat it. I feel even worse than I look. Man, if it wasn't for Ivor, she wouldn't even be like this. Ah, no kidding. That's not exactly true. Ivor built the Wither, sure, but he couldn't have done it without that skull I gave him. If I'd just taken a second to think about it, all I cared about was getting that stupid diamond. This isn't your fault. It's Ivor's. Who wouldn't do something stupid for a diamond? But without my help, Ivor wouldn't have... Wouldn't have wanted revenge on Gabriel? Believe me, he would have found another way. Still, I'm gonna do everything I can. Petra, I know this isn't easy to hear. You're too sick to be going anywhere. I'm not that sick. Maybe you should rest in this cave for a while. I mean, it's safe, defensible. If I say I'm fine, then I'm <coughs> fine. If you try to keep going, I'm afraid you're not going to make it. No, no way. I'm not a quitter. We're not saying you are. I can do this, guys. You staying here is the right move. 
You'll never get better if we keep pushing you. But I want to be there for you guys. I know you do, and you will. Maybe you're right. It's the right call, Jesse. I hope so. I'm not gonna lie, man. But we've pulled through worse, right? Have we? How's it going? Tell me, Jesse. Who is this person? He keeps insulting me. One minute I think I'm talking to a friend, the next I'm being made fun of. He's a member of the Order of the Stone. The Order of the what now? The Order of the Stone? It's the greatest band of heroes ever assembled. Hmm. And how do I know him exactly? I sense we have a history, but... I feel I need a little reminder. Are you kidding me? You're both in the Order. Really? Really? You go way back. It isn't working. He doesn't remember. Talk to him about your past, something only you would know about. Like what? It's been so long since we've seen each other. I'm not really sure what would be useful. Talk about fighting the Ender Dragon. No, 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 no. Anything but that. Come on, it's what you're famous for. <sighs> well, all right then. The Ender Dragon. You see, it was huge. And dangerous. And for a while there, it looked like we were goners. But you know who stepped in and killed that thing? Um, was it Jesse? Huh? No! It was you, man! You killed it! Oh. Thank you for sharing that with me. And Jesse, thank you too. You've been a big help here. I, uh, I need to repay your kindness. I'm not sure how exactly. But I want to express my gratitude. It's no problem. I'd have done it for anyone. All the same, you have my thanks. Now then, tell me more about this Ender Dragon. Man, I don't even know where to begin. <laughs> Sorry, Ruben. I don't really feel like company. <laughs> Ruben! <sighs> I'm glad you came along. Just don't tell Reuben I said that. He might get jealous. Reuben! Don't run off on me like that, okay? didn't mean it, Ruben. She's just not herself right now. Yeah, I know. I, I wish she would get better, too. The world needs us, Ruben. So much of it has already been reduced to bedrock, and it's up to us to save the rest of it. Well, maybe that is a lot of pressure for just a person and a pig, but we have to find a way. That's what I said, isn't it? Just as you once helped us before. This isn't about the past, it's about the future. Petra, are you sure you're okay? I'm fine, Jesse. I just need to rest for a bit. did that by locking the command block away. So only you... Soren, you need to listen to me. Oh, what good has ever come of that? What are you doing here, Ivor? Come to lock me in another room? I came to offer my help. Ha! He's been following us. It's not like that. You need to hear me out. 
What you don't understand is, you are all in very grave danger. <laughs> Obviously! No, I mean specifically this group. The Witherstorm isn't acting randomly. It's following Gabriel. Gabriel? You see, I may have programmed it to follow his amulet. You mean the Order's amulet? Yes, Soren. That amulet. Oh, don't be so dramatic. Did you also know I was the one he gave the amulet to? What? I... I didn't know. Ah, Ivor, you fool. You've created a monster that's following Jesse, and it's only getting stronger. You don't think I realize that? Nothing can stop those things. Nothing even hurts them. Well, except Enderman. Enderman? Jesse's right. The Withers' gaze passed over them, and they went wild. Soren, do you think Enderman could actually destroy one of those things? Well, it's not beyond imagination. If there were enough of them working together, it's a promising concept, at least in theory. If I'm seeing all the pieces correctly. Could you coordinate the Endermen somehow? Make them attack all at once? If I know my Endermen, all we'd need to do is get them into the storm's vicinity. In fact, there's probably more than enough of them still in my fortress. An unintended side effect of you flooding the end. This is just like the old days, Soren. You and your crazy ideas... Hush, Ivor, for once! Ugh. The question is, how to bring the storms and the Endermen together? Endermen aren't pets. They don't follow orders. At least, not from mere mortals. We know for a fact the Witherstorm will follow the amulet. So, if we take the amulet back to your fortress where the Endermen are... Yes! Yes, that's it! We'll lead them straight into a massive trap! If we can't bring the Endermen to the Witherstorms, we bring the Witherstorms to the Endermen. Just one problem. You're forgetting about the command block! Ugh. Yes. It's clear now that no weapon can destroy it. Not even a Formidabomb. Actually, I may have a solution to that. You see, when I first took possession of the command block... You mean, stole it? Yes, well, I created a failsafe. A backup plan, for just in case. Well, I'd say just in case is here. And I'm inclined to agree. Are you saying you know how to destroy the command block? I'm saying there might be a way. What way? An enchanting book. One that contains the power of the command block itself. Use it to enchant a weapon, and you'll be able to smash the command block to bits. Forever! Yes. Yes, that's it. It could very well solve all our problems. What are we waiting for? Let's go get that book. Just one problem. It's at my secret lab, which is... Sort of far away. How far could it possibly be? Let's just say it's the farthest place a person can travel before being utterly... Oh dear, what was that? I can't believe it found us so quickly. It just keeps coming for us. Well, we can't stand around and wait for it. So what do we do? Guys, there's a reason it's been following us. Ivor says it's because of the amulet that Gabriel... Ivor! It is you! Good to see you too, Magnus. Hello. My name is Gabriel. Somebody pinch me. Anyway, Ivor's figured out the Witherstorms are drawn to the amulet, so we're gonna lure them back to Soren's fortress and destroy the command block with an enchanted super weapon. You figured all that out just now? The point is we need to get moving. We aren't safe. Not as long as we have that amulet. I'll take it. You can't. I can, and I have to. But you could be killed. We all could, Olivia. Axel, are you sure? Of course not. But you'll have three Witherstorms chasing you wherever you go. Yeah, if things get too intense, I'll duck into the nether or something. 
tired of always being the selfish one. You just go make that super weapon. I'll meet you back at Soren's fortress. Well, Axel shouldn't have to do this alone. I'm coming with you, man. Nice. Well, I'm going with Jesse. I, I pledge to help, and that's what I must do. But Lucas is out there all by himself. There's nothing you can do for him now. Everyone, take good care of yourselves. You too. Hey, Jesse. Let's try our handshake again, just once for the road. The warrior's whip? You got it. Oh, well. Real heroes don't need handshakes anyway. I'll see you at Soren's, all right? Not if I see you first. Are we there yet? Almost there. Can't be much longer, right? No, not too much longer. Are we there yet? No, 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 we are not there yet. Profoundly sore. Feels like we've been riding forever. I am telling you, we cannot go to the Far Lands. They're not just the edge of our world, but the limits of our comprehension. Oh, please. The Far Lands are a happy accident. Nature's way of keeping life interesting. No, no, no. They are perilous and unpredictable. Pearl in noise, floating points. These are not matters to be toyed with. Why are you so down on the Far Lands, Soren? They sound cool. See? Jesse thinks the Far Lands are cool. The Far Lands lie at the very edge of all things, where logic gives way to chaos. They're a dangerous place to visit, and a ridiculous place to construct a laboratory. <laughs> Just wait until you see it. Do those two never stop arguing? I don't know. I'm too hungry to care. No kidding. I'm starving. Maybe we should turn back? This isn't the time. Swamps are too dangerous. You never know what might be lurking around. What was that? My stomach. All right, let's just 
rest for a minute. Everyone's hungry, and we could use a breather. We mustn't linger long. The Far Lands are just beyond this swamp. So this could be our last chance to find food? Potato, you're coming with me. Not much, but it'll help. Like they say, two potatoes is better than one. I think they say that. Hey, Jesse, have you found any food? I should probably take what I have back to the group. Witch's hut. Ah! We should steer clear of it. Nothing good ever happens when witches are involved. Look, a cake! That's that's enough to feed everyone. It isn't worth it, Jesse. Witches hate trespassers. Besides, there are plenty of potatoes around. Is that a witch? <laughs> Jesse, we shouldn't be here. Witches are very strong. Ivor, I can't pass this up. I need you to watch my back, okay? I'm telling you, this is a bad idea. I'll keep watch. Just be quick about it. A potion of leaping. Cool! I wonder what horrible stuff's been brewed in there. Ivor! Ivor? Jesse! We need assistance! said the Far Lands are just past the swamp. Wait, where is Ivor? I thought he was with you. I don't know. He disappeared outside the witch's hut. Curse that fool of a man. Come on! <laughs> Guys, I think we lost them for... Wow! You lost them for wow? What is that? Oh, wow. It's like we're at the edge of the world. Actually, we seem to be at the corner of it. Welcome to the Far Lands, my friend. I'd feel a lot better about going into this crazy wall thingy if I wasn't still hungry. But at least Jesse found those potatoes. That might be the saddest sentence ever uttered. <laughs> Quite a sight, isn't it? Stretching skyward in all its glory. This wall? Did Ivor build this? No, of course not. This is a natural phenomenon. The intersection of two of the great walls that form the boundary of our world. Incredible. You can say that again. Incredible. My fault. Should have seen that coming. Ivor really went out of his way to make sure he'd never have visitors, huh? He was always secretive. It was both his weakness and his strength. Whatever Ivor's hiding in here, it will be extremely well guarded.
This way, I suspect. I'd feel better about this if the rest of our group was with us. Come on! Is this... a maze? It would appear so. A massive one from the looks of it. If Ivor used the command block to build this, it could hold unspeakable peril. Why do I sense that entering this so-called maze would be a grave mistake? Because some part of you still knows Ivor. Unfortunately, this seems to be the only way forward. There has to be another way. A secret door, or... I don't know. Some way around. There's no way we're going into some crazy maze that Ivor built to keep people away. We'll find some other way through. Best decision you've made all day. Ivor needs to take better care of this place. Probably climb these. Everyone, on guard! There's too many! We can't fight them all! <sighs> Guys, climb the vines! Well, that worked, I suppose. Yeah, I guess. But now what do we do? We're all separated. Let's just head that way and find a place where the pads connect. Sure hope they don't get lost in there. I hope I don't get lost in there.
This place just gets weirder and weirder. Yikes! Shoot! You have got to be kidding me. Olivia! What's that? Looks like Ivor kept some redstone dust handy. And a slime ball. Stone block, that'll come in handy. Huh, redstone blocks, some pistons. Wonder what this thing's supposed to be. Hello? Anyone? Olivia, is that you? Jesse, there you are. <laughs> I thought I'd never find you. All those dead ends back there. Am I glad to see you guys? Us two. I thought Reuben and I would be lost in here forever. <coughs> this maze? We don't have time for this. Who even knows where the others are by now? <coughs> I mean, the clock's ticking here, Jesse. Yet we're lost in some elaborate puzzle. Well, we've got to push on to Ivor's lab somehow. Too bad there's a gaping bottomless pit in the way. What about this thing? Could it get us across? It's some kind of flying barge. It would probably get us to the other side. But it's in really bad shape. And it's really complicated. You can fix it though, right? 
I don't know. I think it's out of my league. I wish I'd had more time to study with Eligard. Come on, I'll help you. How are you gonna help me when I don't even know where to start? This layout doesn't even make any sense. What was Ivor thinking? Or maybe it's just me. I mean, Eligard herself said I don't have what it takes to be a great engineer. She was right, I just can't hack it. I might as well be a carrot farmer. So prove her wrong. Show the world what you're made of. Prove her wrong? Jesse, she was the greatest redstone engineer ever. She was in the Order of the Stone. Sure, but the Order are still people, just like us. Right. Just like us. I mean, how are we the ones saving the world when even they don't have what it takes? Soren and Ivor are always at each other's throats. The greatest warrior in history doesn't remember his own name. All I ever see Magnus do is argue, and we both know what happened to Eligard. If the Order can't do this, how are we supposed to? How are we supposed to do anything? We're nobody. The Order of the Nothing. You know what? We're better than them. Better than the Order? I don't know about that. I mean, they defeated an Ender Dragon. Can you name even one thing we've done right? And I don't mean managing to stay alive. Something that actually matters. Well, for starters, we're the ones who brought them back together again. You and I found Eligard together. We both played a role with Soren. Yeah, I suppose that's true. Ah, all right. I'll try it one more time. Wait a second. I think I see what he was trying to do. Jesse, take this piston, craft it into a sticky piston, then place it on the other side of the barge, along with a redstone block. You got all that? I think so. The sooner the better. Okay, let's put the redstone block where it's supposed to go and place these pistons. Holy cow, we did it! We need flint and steel to get it started. I'm proud of you, Olivia. Thanks, Jesse. And thanks for everything you said just before. It really helped. No problemo. It must be this way. Run! Everybody get on. Quick, onto the barge. Jesse! That was close. Everyone okay? For the moment. I remember something. Didn't Eligard build a machine like this once? Yes, in the nether. <clears throat> and you were terrified of flying on it. What? Stuff and nonsense. <laughs> no, no, I'm positive. You spent the whole ride quivering in terror. Soren, is that true? Of course not. <laughs> <laughs> well, I suppose I might be mistaken. Mm, I liked you better when you had amnesia.
Well, that was exciting. Uh, by exciting, I assume you mean absurd and unnecessary. Let's go see what he's hiding in there. 